Meghan Markle snub, expert claims Thomas Markle could never see royal baby Meghan Markle will not let Thomas Markle SNR visit the new royal baby, according to a royal expert, as the Duchess of Sussex is not going to put herself in the position of a potential leak from her father, who is destroying their relationship with his media outbursts Meghan Markle and Prince Harry are now excitedly awaiting the birth of their royal baby, with a due date approaching in late April. However, after Thomas Markle, SNR's recent release of a personal letter from the Duchess, which came after multiple attacks on the couple in the press, many are wondering whether the Duke and Duchess of Sussex will introduce their firstborn to Meghan's father. Podcast Royals, from Australian magazine New Idea, here's from royal expert Angela Mollard, who talks about the magazine's latest two-part series with Meghan's half-brother Thomas Markle JNR. Mize Mallard said, it doesn't bode well. It's quite ominous, I think. He says that their heartbroken father is considering releasing a whole mountain of personal letters, photos and videos in a desperate attempt to bring about some sort of reconciliation. Is that going to work? I don't think so. She continued, he even goes so far opening bracket as closing bracket to say that his dad would love to be at the birth. Well, that's not going to happen is it? Mies Mollard shared her opinion that the Duchess would not put herself in the position where her father could blab about her and her new baby, meaning it could be that he never sees his grandchild. She said, Some people are just not emotionally capable of doing the right thing and I think Thomas Markle is it. He's destroying this relationship that he's had with his daughter. She continued, Having a potential closeness with his daughter and her baby would have to be very strictly on the condition that he doesn't blab, and he's shown himself to do that. Podcast host Rebecca Hyde asked, He opening bracket Thomas J.R. closing bracket really wants his dad to be able to see Meghan and Harry's baby do you think this is going to happen? Mize Mallard replied, I don't, actually. I think that Meghan was trying to repair that relationship via the letter prior to the baby being born. When you become a mother, you really an us, you're very protective of your child. This is her new family now and that will be cemented by having the new baby. I think if she ends up in a situation with her child, with Thomas, and if he takes a photo and disseminates opening bracket it closing bracket, that's going to feel like an enormous travesty to her and she's not going to put herself in that position. Mize Mollard also said that Thomas Markle JNR and Samantha Markle were not helping matters. She added, I think the more they bang on about this, the less likely Megan is to build that bridge to her dad. She concluded, I don't hold up high hopes for this relationship being reconciled. I'd love to think that it might but I really don't think it's going to happen. However, Mize Mollard's opinion comes in contrast to a royal source's insight, which was revealed today. A royal insider told the Daily Mail, Meghan hopes and prays that the baby will bring her family back together. They said, she plans to extend an olive branch to the family and invite them to visit after the baby is born her sister Samantha Markle included. A source told Mill Online, she plans to extend an olive branch to the family and invite them to visit after the baby is born her sister included. Meghan hopes and prays that the baby will bring her family back together. The source also claims Meghan is hopeful her family will try and make a difference rather than criticize her. Meghan also appeared to put another apparent family feud to rest recently when she was seen warmly embracing Kate Middleton. The pair seemed pleased to see each other and warmly embraced after they exchanged a cheerful greeting, Juddy James claimed. Kate, 37, and Meghan's happy meeting could finally end rumors of an apparent rift, which has plagued the royals for months. Mize James said there were authentic signs of affection during their meeting ahead of the Commonwealth Day service. Meghan and Harry's baby is due in spring. What do you think? Share your thoughts in the comment section below and don't forget to subscribe to get instant news update.